This year we are presenting our new photo measurement system. If you like to know how to save time and money, please watch this video. Thank you for the invitation. It was very nice to come here to Cologne to see and to meet you here yeah. at Hotgen Road. Yeah, especially here you have a nice view over the industry area here of Cologne. Yeah. And yeah, we are located here with 130 people yeah. around. What I like most are the photovoltaic uh, installations here around. Yeah. So uh, which products do you offer for installers and uh, planners in PV? We offer uh, mostly products for quick measurement system uh -huh. to make quick offers and stuff like that, to make it very simple in the daily work of mm -hmm. their uh, work and for simulation products for getting information how much energy I can get, how much I can use for my own, uh, I have to deliver into the grid and st uh, stuff like that. What I learned is that you have um, tools for heating, yeah. for um, heat pumps, you have tools for PV, of course, and uh, hydraulic systems, mm -hmm. everything like that. And then you have tools for uh, photo measurements. Yeah. You're starting with uh, pictures, with photo photographs. How do you make it with the data from the photo to the PV si simulation, let's say? We try to see the building as a whole, first yeah. of all. And then we developed a data model that we uh, give the customer the possibility with one data input to get more results out of different calculations. For example, PVs or just the first information out of photos yeah. to get them into yeah, more complicated simulation programs, so to say. Yeah. But um, it's important for them to just gather the information once and not to put it all the time again into software products. How does it work with the photo measurement and starting? Uh, to be honest, that's easier to show than to describe. So oh, you want to take a look? Forward. Show me, please. Yeah. yeah? Okay. Yeah. The I first step, to. first step, of course, you need a picture. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's that's why it's called From photo measurement. Yeah. A picture right. of the building. So, for example, we get a picture. Uh -huh. Yeah, just to zoom it a little bit in. Make sure you see a bit, bit of the roof, yeah, for example, yeah, and just do a picture. And now, with one information of the roof, for example, just one information, for example, a window size yeah, or yeah, something, okay. like, something that, like that, we can measure the whole roof and say how many uh, modules will fit on it. So you only have to know one dimension. Yeah, one, one or two. Instance, two would be better. And everything but else is made by the by the software. Yeah. So that's easy. Then you have the photo and um, the dimensions of the roof in your notebook and then you can put it directly into the PV simulation for module planning and something like that. Yeah, we have two versions of the photo measurement system, where it's quick and dirty to say. Okay. And to say to make yeah, it on so an beginning, app, right. um, if you get to uh, drive to others and just make it there. Mm -hmm. And you can send your photo, of course, to a desktop version, and then you can do it very exactly. And the information out of it, for example, how many models you plan on it, yeah, they can get into the simulation product. Okay, so you have a database for inverters, a database for modules, you have uh, climate data in the PV simulation. How often do you update this uh, information? Here yeah, it's frequently updated once per month. Okay. Uh, so that's the uh, cyclus for um, the inverters and PV modules. The climate data normally every two or every three months uh, updates available if you want to. Okay. You don't have to. And if you have planned your PV system on the rooftop, then you have electrical data, you know, you have the consumption in the building, you have the uh, storage, electrical storage maybe, you have electromobility, you have electrical heating. You, you take this all together in one uh, tool, so you can plan the whole building, the, uh, the, the supply of the whole building. From it. Yeah, the key is you can, you don't have to. Okay. So we have different solutions and for a completely building simulation, mm -hmm. yeah, to say all of the kind want to calculate for the building and for the customer inside the building. But you can also say, it, I, I'm just interested in the PV plus um, my storage. Uh -huh. yeah? It doesn't matter what kind of storage it is, there are technical information behind it, you can choose. Uh -huh. And just to say, um, based on your project, what kind of tool is the best to fit in this kind of project. Okay. Yeah. And is the size of the building limited? We have uh, private use, we have commercial use like here, we have industrial utility use. So The size itself doesn't matter for, for the calculation parts of our product. Uh, of course it's based on, on the time if you get a very uh, 
big project, you need a little more time than a small project, that's of course, but there's no restrictions in the calculation field. Okay. What are your customers, preferably? Yeah, most of our customers exactly are different like uh, other software companies. We most uh, develop software for, for example, craftsmen also. Mm -hmm. to, to make Installers. Yeah, installers, craftsmen, and also planners, architects, stuff like that. So we start, first of all, after the first um, draw of a building, for example, in uh, new buildings, and then make calculations, heating losses, cooling losses, energy losses itself, PV simulations, uh, a different kind of havoc pl uh, planning tools, and combine it to um, quick results, what will it bring? Uh -huh. yeah, and what does it cost? Yeah. You come from two sides, so maybe from the PV side, from the roof, yeah. and from the building side, on the other hand too, so if you want to. Yeah. yeah. So we are very proud of the flexibility of our software tools. So everyone can choose the fitting product and combine them if they okay. want to. Some people just need a product for uh, four euros a month, for example, mm -hmm. photo measurement, a mobile thing, or they can get complete planning software for more than 1,000 euros, yeah? so that's up to them. Uh, which are your markets? Where are your customers? Uh? Yeah, most of them are normal, located in Germany, uh, Austria and Switzerland. How, how many uh, do you have? In, uh, that's about 60,000. Um, 60,000, okay, yeah. that's a lot. Right now, uh -huh. and I'm talking about the regular users, so they get updates. That's B2B users? Yeah, only yeah. B2B. Yeah, yeah. And do you have uh, international markets uh, maybe to step into in the future? Yeah, we want to, yeah. especially in uh, Spain and for example France, we are very interested to get into this market. Yeah. We've got first corporations there and we try to get into this market, yes. So, thank you very much. So we have a look at the customer service side, right? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. Okay, put me on. <laughs>